This class is factory experimental, or better known as FX. They are highly modified mowers that you would never see in your neighbor's backyard. That's right, you'd never see them in your neighbor's backyard the way they are now, but that's where they started, your neighbor's backyard, behind the garage, behind a junk pile, but now they are screaming racing machines. <laughs> FX class, look at this depth in the starting lineup. Kevin Penny won last year, we'll see if he can repeat. Matt Tucker's in this one, Wally Bender. These are serious veterans ready to go at it for a scheduled 20 lap race in FX. Penny Miller and Hatchell, 19 year veterans on the Stable Series circuit. Fans love it, the racers love it. A rolling start here to start the FX final. Will the inside pay? Not early on here. The 109 of Matt Tucker making noise in that green machine on the outside. And taking a look to the inside is Kevin Penny in that Thunderbolt number 104. He's in third right now on the inside. Man, is this a great race early on. Oh, here he goes for second. Outstanding start to this race. Tucker, Bender, Penny, Miller, Honchel, all veterans. And we just got a glimpse of that yellow machine. Mike Miller bringing the heat in fourth right now. And here goes Penny for the lead. There goes Cooter sprung loose now. Watch him. <laughs> Kevin Petty, known as Cooter, is certainly trying to scoot away here. Man, look at him negotiate that back dog leg. He's really getting it done here. Penny quickly to a 3-4 more length lead. Kevin using that John Deere 111 with a Honda block. Really tricked out. Factory Experimental, a tinkerer's dream. You could do all kinds of things to the engines. Just a great, great class to really tinker and have some fun. And Bruce, we noticed the track is changing just a little bit. We see you going to turn number one. And in Kevin Penny going through the corner there, a little bit of dust flying, but I don't think that's the only concern they have. The skies look to be threatening at this point in the race. That's right, temperature's dropping a little bit. We're watching the rain. It could come in any time, so we're trying to make sure it's safe and we beat the rain. So we're kicking up a little dust right there off of turn number one. A lot of racing all weekend long. 11 classes get to race, some at qualifying heats. Whoa, Penny almost over. Two wheel, and that's a veteran move there to try to balance it back. The body, the human body is such a part of how these guys get to the corners, Bruce. And each class is a little bit different too, Jim. For example, the IMO class, you kind of lean over the side of your machine. In the FX class, you have to stay close and tight. And also a special shout out to Kenny Holder, currently in sixth place right now, our physician, Dr. Mo, uh, <laughs> doctor out of Kentucky, Doc Mo, Kenny Holder, getting it done in FX. So I get to sit next to Mr. Mo at all, and we have Dr. Mo in this race. What could get, what could get better? Well, the Hedgehog right there, number 16, <laughs> Mike Miller, the Hedgehog out of Kenosha, Wisconsin. Great battle here. The 109 we mentioned is Matt Tucker, who had the early race lead now. He's settled to the inside groove. But look at Miller pressure him now at the battle for a second. And these two machines have been battling out on the Stable Series all year. Penny out to a comfortable lead. There he is. Burping the throttle there. Penny trying to keep all four wheels on the on the uh, turf as we saw him go two wheel in there through turn three just a lap or so ago. Well, Kevin Penny told us before the race his cardinal rules of lawnmower racing. One, finish under power. Two, don't hurt anyone. And three, have fun. <laughs> hey, one thing to bring up is the experimental point of this. A lot of guys pushing the limits, so it's a matter of keeping that together for 20 whole laps. It is indeed, and we've also added four new classes, two of them being FX and FXT, which even allows you to do more modifications in the machine, so the sport keeps expanding. We've also added other classes to make it more affordable, so we are rocking and mowing with many new classes this year. And we now see our race leader, Kevin Penny, taking a very wide line because the track is beginning to get damp. The skies are starting to open here at the Delaware County Fairgrounds. And safety first, our chief stewards, Rodney Peeler, Richard Webb, Kerry Evans, Chrissy Webb, our top flight crew is going to make that call if it gets too slick. And it's really raining now, Jim. Some of these are go-kart tires. This class can allow also mini sprint tires. But again, that's not a lot of traction on this racetrack. And you can see them sliding around here trying to get some grip. Yeah, we're watching. You can see that rain. Mother Nature's doing her thing. We're going to call this the final lap in FX. Factory Experimental. Kevin Penny has had the race in hand. Now Everso slightly trying to make his way through the corner. He got the signal. That still means he has to cross the finish line here. Kevin Penny in that 104 octane machine now just slowly making his way through. The rain is really starting to pick up here. Boy, it's really washing out this race course. And we'll checker it here. Kevin Penny will get the checkers. 17 of our 20 laps in, and boy, Penny had no challengers once he took the lead away from Matt Tucker. Great job by Penny in the wet, and another championship to Kevin Penny out of Illinois. Let's check in with our race winner. Well, Mother Nature held off a long time, guys, but it came out there in the middle of that race. Kevin Penny, congratulations. You won here before, former champion, but you got it done here. 20th anniversary, man, congrats.
I've been, I've been doing this 19 years, so if I had one more year, it'd be 2020. Ah, oh, this is great, man. The track held up great. There's so many variables that can go wrong in a race like this, and I just dotted my I's, crossed the T's, and hoped for the best, did some driving, and oh, man, it, it all worked out. Kevin Penny wins the race. Wally Bender wins the national championship over Matt Tucker. Let's check in with the champ. Wally Bender, class champion FX. Uh, what did you think when the rain came out there? Because I, I know it can get pretty greasy pretty quick. Well, it, it did. It got greasy real quick, and I was not set up at all for that. I really wasn't set up for the track we had. Um, and But Kevin Nipper broke down before we even got out on the track. I hate to win that way, but, you know, that's racing, but you got to keep it going. And uh, I'm really sorry for him, uh, and, uh, but it was, a, it was a good race.